This way. The base is not far now. Let's hope we don't need it. Well, we survived our first storm together. Yes, we did. I'm glad we got to see each other again. How long are you staying on Jetta? I don't know. But I am excited to see Greece. How are you doing? Not bad. He opened up a cantina. Hyloon Saloon. You named it after his great grandma. Nothing's more important to Greece than family. Hello, my friend. It's so very good to see you again. Master Cordova. It's an honor. I... I never thought I'd meet you in person. The honor is mine, Cal. Sears told me everything. You have demonstrated great bravery and wisdom in the face of overwhelming adversity. You chose well? Well, <laughs> I wouldn't go that far. <laughs> the Empire has claimed the ruins. We'll have to find another rendezvous point. Unfortunate. But at least the storm covered your tracks. Come. Come, let me escort you inside. Master Cordova. Did you find the Zepho? Only faint traces of their passage heading deep into the unknown regions. Sorry to hear that. As it goes. Ultimately, that failure inspired me to seek out other Jedi survivors. That search led me back to my old apprentice. How have you been faring, Cal? That doesn't sound good. I've had a few scrapes, but I'm still breathing. And I'm glad for it. I heard some news about a Jedi terrorist on Coruscant not long ago. You were on Coruscant? Well, the Mantis looks like it's seen other days. You should see the other guys. This base is well hidden. Yes. Well, the Empire's presence has grown these past years. They are much too strong to fight directly. But we do what we can. It is critical, of course, that our work remains secret. What work exactly? Better to ask Seer yourself. Meanwhile, Marin and I will greet our new arrivals. So, how was the desert? Cold, stormy, and too many Imperials. Mm, not my preferred weather forecast. But more common by the day. 
Where did you weather the storm? A cave past the old market. Our Spamel friend showed us the way. You've a habit for making new friends wherever you go. A survival instinct, perhaps. I intercepted some Imperial communications. Your reputation is growing. Was there fear in their voices? Quite a bit, yes. Good. How are you feeling? Better. That tea you brought me was wonderful. Just keep trying. It's not like Brother Armai has to break contact. Cal Kestis. Welcome to Jeddah. I knew the storm wouldn't deter you. You're rebuilding the temple archives. Well, we're trying. As long as this knowledge remains, the legacy of the Jedi survives. It's incredible. Mm -hmm. But something tells me there's more to this than just hollow books. Yes. We're a part of a network known as the Hidden Path. We provide safe passage and new identities to those who have been persecuted by the Empire. Hunted by the Empire, like. like Jedi survivors? Very few of us remain. But yes. And Force Sensitives, and those who help them. Why didn't you tell me? <laughs> you never asked. Besides, I hear you've been busy making yourself the Empire's most wanted. I wanted to prove to the galaxy that the Empire is an invulnerable. That you can resist. That you have to fight if things are gonna get better. But then they just listen to the propaganda and they pretend they're free anyways. Hmm. Yeah. You chose a hard path. And it hasn't made a difference. Well, while the Empire's trained its eyes on you, we've been able to build the network, find allies, and save lives. When you left, uh, you'd just given up. I was wrong. Cal, you were just a child when they sent you off to war. You know, there was a time when I remember that the Jedi were more than just weapons. But we both have our roles to play in this struggle. Yeah, but that's why I'm here. See her. Well, you get a load of this! Hey, Seer, you can't say it ain't short of personality, <laughs> but kind of creepy, though. <laughs> well, it's good to see you two, Grease. <laughs> <laughs> well, oh, hello, oh, BD. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> so, how was your time in the desert? The storm covered our tracks, but the Empire destroyed one of your speeders. It's a small price to pay for everybody's safe arrival. And who's this? This is Bodokuna. He is a friend. It's so nice to finally meet you. Uh, this hunk of trouble! <laughs> hey! We're all together! Huh? Yes. Now, what brings you all to Jeddah? We're searching for a lost planet. Tantalor, you ever heard of it? It's on the other side of a deadly nebula called the Kobo Abyss. Well, our archives are far from complete, but I'm sure Master Cordova is up to the task. With pleasure. The trouble is, we're not the only ones looking for this place. I knew this was sounding too easy. Guy's name is Dagon Gera. He was a Jedi. Now he leads a band of raiders on the Outer Rim. 
There's an old temple there. Dagon intends to reclaim it. A Jedi temple out of the reach of the Empire could mean that there's information there that we don't have in the Archive. I believe I have something. <laughs> oh, you're too kind, BD. <laughs> I'll start with the bad news. Well, oh boy. This guy knows his audience. <sighs> I found no information related to crossing the Kobo Abyss. However, I found two mentions of this Dagon Gera. He had a retreat on Kobo. And records show him frequently visiting a laboratory on its moon. Okay, we'll check him out. If you find anything, bring it to me. I am happy to assist further. Thank you. Both of you. You're welcome, Cal. I hope you find what you're searching for. May the Force be with you. And with you. I will escort you back to the Mantis. So you're not joining us? I cannot. I've had this since I started freelancing. It's gotten me out of some bad situations, and I figured it might do the same for you. It's Marin, right? Well, I could get another one, if you think you might want it. No need. Both. <laughs> yeah, you're, you're good. Okay. My master always frowned upon using blasters. You once said it wasn't the weapon that makes you a Jedi. <laughs> It's us against the galaxy, Cal. We've got to use every advantage we can find against the Empire. Thanks, Bo. Now, I'll show you how to use it. Stay still. Gotta start somewhere. There you go. Not bad, Jedi. Impressive. I think you got it, Cal. It's nice seeing you again, Marin. You too, Cal. Good luck. Perhaps I will still be here when you return. Hope so. So where are we headed first? Back to Kobo? Or it's Moon? Let's hit the Moon Laboratory first. All right. Maybe we can find something there to help us cross the Abyss. I can't believe Master Cordova is really here. All that time following in his footsteps. I have enjoyed getting to know him. I've never met a Jedi with a better sense of humor. You've only met me and Seer. That's right. Droid, try not to get Kel in too much trouble. This is a smart operation Seer's put together. Why do you say that? All this rock? Natural shielding against sensors. Yeah, and if anyone makes it past all that, the Anchorites have plenty of hollow books to throw at them. <laughs> And you can see how Sears managed to evade the Empire for so long. She makes her own luck, keeping so much of her power held back to achieve a larger goal. Yeah. There's definitely more to her than meets the eye. You two have that in common. Ah, 
All right, let's pick where we go next. Maybe those anchorites aren't so bad after all. Didn't you call them weirdos? That was before Seer told me they're helping those poor refugees hide from the Empire. That right? Yeah. Working with the group called the Hidden Path. Real hush-hush stuff. So keep it in the family. Understood. Seems like you've got a nice crew. Oh, former crew. You know what I mean. Do I? So, Cordova thinks we'll find out how to cross the abyss by tracking down Dagon's old haunts? That's right. You ever been there? Once. Used to be a settlement. Now it's just a bunch of crumbling stone spires and creepy ruins. All right, kids, sit down. We're here. yourself around the stone spires, Cal. What'd you hear? Apparently the raider base isn't too far from there. Thanks for the warning. Master Cordova's research shows an abandoned settlement past the east side of the valley. Let's go check it out. Private table. All right, then. Whoa, easy, Grok. Sorry about my friend here. He's just a little guarded. Yeah, I get it. Hmm. Name's Dana. You might say my partner and I have a talent for turning opportunity into profit. I'm Cal. This is BD. Noisy little thing. We're thinking of heading to Dredger Gorge. Ever been? Once or twice. I'd be careful out there. That's gang turf. Gang turf? Grok! Sure it ain't that bad. The hell I'm risking my neck on gang turf. <laughs> hey, it was great meeting you, Cal. Got some business to discuss with my old pal here. <sighs> Come on, BD. One moment. Welcome, welcome. Make yourself at home. How long have the Raiders been here? A few years. Not long after I arrived. I don't know a planet in the Outer Rim free of raiders in general, but these bedlam bastards have changed Kobo forever. Most hunters know you cull when you need to, and you stop hunting when a herd gets too low. These raiders kill for sport, and made a lot of those beasts much more hostile to us. Take Shiverpedes, for example. When they lose habitat, they get territorial and fight back. Same as us, really. Sure enough. Biggest mistake Archon ever made was thinking we are any different. Let's see what we find up here. Susie. Should you find any data discs from my day, I'd be happy to decrypt them for you. I imagine there are many that remain lost on Kobo. We'll let you know if we do.
This place could use some greenery. I wonder if I could find someone to help. Plant this here. Let's plant this here. Take a look, you'll find the finest components in sundries this side of the outer rim. Now that's a Doma Dendra guarantee. Hear that, buddy? A guarantee. That's right. Shop's built on trust and quality, and I aim to keep it that way. Oh, what a helpful droid. Oh, I knew that one would catch your eye.
Should be getting pretty close. I don't see anything like a settlement, though. Let's move. Yeah, let's keep our distance this time. This place is in ruins. Brew tracked us down. Someone in. Done. <laughs> Name's Cage Vander. This mud scuffer picked up your trail outside the outpost. Cal. Sounds like you've been watching us. Oh, we've all been watching, Cal. Not every newcomer introduces themselves by taking down one of Ravis's boys, which, by the way, nice touch. Love a big entrance. Thanks. So what do you want? <sighs> what I want, Cal, is to reward you for every one of these that you take down. Not the only one who came to Kobo for a little peace and quiet. Take these off, bounty hunters. 
and I'll trade you something nice. So he was Haxian and Brood. More bound to be on the way. Exactly. Lucky for you. I've got eyes and ears about. Drop by the saloon, and I'll help you get a jump on those hunters. All right. I'll think it over. Everybody's got rockets except me. Look at this. Come on, buddy. We still gotta find Dagon's retreat. So you didn't feel like helping me out there? For free. I don't think so. Feel the planet and everything connected. Then reach out. I think I... I there! I felt it! Just so. Very good, Parawan. Gotta be the place Cordova was talking about. PlayStation.